one shot, Lacey! Hey, you! Get over here! Those guys are after me! Can you give me a ride past them, please? I'm hardly wearing any makeup! Well, come on, then! Hop in! the hair advice person uh, music from spain music from kyo diet out to everyone chilling right now these are some eager beavers what the hell did you do i'm really famous i didn't do anything this is my average commute so who are you anyway who am i uh, hello take another look reality whore polygamous with nine babies i really don't give a shit how out of touch are you Lacey Jonas, I am the third most bankable actress slash singer in Vinewood. Means nothing to me, Sweet Pea. I'm more of an impotent rage guy. Oh, that is so lame. Hey, it's normal for adult males to find me very appealing. Look at those lunatics. Can you imagine what it's like being this famous? No, but I think you're gonna tell me. The idolizing, the worship, it's so draining! But I'm the closest thing to royalty these people have! Uh, looks like we lost them, oh thank God! Now, would you be a total sweetheart and give me a ride back to the hills? What a day! What, am I your chauffeur now? Oh, pretty please, I can't walk home! Most men would kill for this opportunity. No, like, seriously, I totally appreciate this. Do you want me to put your kids through college or something? My pleasure, oh famous one. Those vultures looked like they'd have torn the meat from your bones. You had any meat to tear. Oh. Please, I'm such a fat little piggy right now. Ugh, too many french fries. I mean, I mostly just suck on them and spit them into a bucket, but that's still probably like a hundred calories. The media love their little Macy Jonas jokes. All that, she's a skeleton, give that girl a sandwich, lameness. Whatever, I bet they're all total hippos. When I get home, I'm like totally gonna suck all my personal trainers. Ugh, what I give to have a normal life for one day. Is that right? Fascinating. No way, are you kidding me? Doing laundry and shampooing my own hair? Ugh, horrendous. No, thank you. I mean, do you have any idea how much money I spent on losing my regional accent? I had to cut all ties with my family. Not because I didn't love them, but because Miss the thought me. of their lame lives was breaking me down spiritually. You know what I mean? You would really not believe how difficult it is being a celebrity sometimes. Oh yeah, no, oh it must be so tough. Like, I can't even imagine. I think the problem is sometimes they love me too much. My publicist told me if you put all my fans together, they'd fill the country of Africa, wherever that is. I had this obsessed fan last year who kept sending me photos of his junk. Then when I didn't reply, he sent me his actual junk in a box, all dried up. It looked like a spring roll. I mean, seriously, how in... Look out! How 
insane is that? And did you know my gynecologist autobiography was the top selling fiction and nonfiction book of 2010? Totally insane, right? Oh, totally. It sucks. They're always comparing me to Poppy Mitchell, and she's such a diva. I'm way more into making a difference than she is. If I wasn't in entertainment, I'd totally be a doctor or a lawyer. It's so important to me to stay they're grounded cute, but they're and stupid. connect with real people, you know? That's the only way you truly grow as an artist. Literally, nobody tests higher than me on relatability. I mean, you can tell I'm so girl next door, right? Are you listening to me? Oh, I'm hanging on your every word. In China, I always travel with lookalikes. I find the language so scary. All those letters look like tattoos. Hey, old fella. <laughs> what do you got? What do you got? I heard you're interested in taking care of some lost travelers for a price. And so it is. And so it is. Leave the body. Take the gold. Come on! Move! Move! 